Hey guys and girls, this is Ritwik. You are watching Rithi Cards. I hope you guys are healthy and staying at home. This video took me longer than usual because I tried to paint a real person in mobile. Last time I painted something like this is the Batman Nightmare. You guys can see the i button. If you want to see that video, go and click the i button. But before that, watch this video full. I am sorry for the fast movement, but the video you're watching is 12 times faster than the real one. If I had an iPad or I, I draw in the Procreate, then uh, that would be very easy to lock the layers and uh, I can uh, record the full screen. Um, so I have been thinking about iPad recently and uh, I hope I am going to buy that soon because if you ask me then uh, we really cannot draw a hyper realistic painting in 5 or 6 inch screen um, and uh, guys uh, I want you to know that recently I have joined Patreon and I really uh, don't know how to use it it is very confusing I wish I could use it uh, and uh, get some support from you guys if anyone know how to run a Patreon account please feel free to inbox me on Instagram uh, I will give my uh, Instagram idol link in the description. If you guys want to uh, know whom I am drawing, so this is uh, Sheetal Mustaria. She is an influencer on Instagram and uh, she got hype for this picture uh, in all over social media. And uh, I don't know if I'm looking, uh, I'm, I mean, making it correctly. I think uh, she is much more prettier and beautiful. She is. Uh, looking very beautiful the simple way she dressed so i thought uh, i should definitely try to draw a beautiful chick like her uh, normally i uh, don't, uh, don't draw real pictures much but uh, it was necessary okay uh, so uh, my tea came uh, i'm going to drink the tea now yeah here yeah, guys i prefer tea more than coffee uh, i literally don't have any other addiction except tea <laughs> Uh, whatever so guys uh, every artist uh, have their own way to drawing a picture and um, I Focus on the face too much, but I will definitely say uh, I love the way I drew the belly. It feels really real uh, Still uh, it was easy to make but uh, I was so confused when I was drawing the neck and the collarbone It was very frustrating uh, and uh, I want to tell you guys that um I shouldn't ask for this but I really want 100 likes on this video this is funny I know uh, I wouldn't get 100 likes but uh, still I am asking for just support give me 100 likes uh, this is this will really give me some hope if you guys give me 100 likes then it would really uh, give some hope in my art you know uh, and uh, I, guys we are in quarantine now so don't give me excuse that you cannot like my video so, so uh, right now it doesn't uh, look like the actual complete painting uh, it will change a lot later in the video uh, and I am really happy with the hair to the hair will get some serious shit uh, and um, I had been working on this picture for almost four days and um, I didn't do any other work and um, I have been thinking about doing a uh, live streaming on YouTube for more engagement but uh, i cannot do it now for some technical reasons i uh, will definitely do it if you guys want to give me any suggestions or tips for digital arts or how should i record then comment down below it will really help me to grow the way audience want uh the detailing in uh, the sari way to go good uh, i am happy with the result and also the ear pieces i didn't think uh, i could focus on these things but uh, i did i uh, really uh, want to upload some normal artworks but uh, I don't have a good setup for hand drawings record that's why I cannot and uh, also I need a lot of practice for traditional sketches one quote um, I really believe that practice makes people perfect and uh, I am I mean I really not focusing much in my hand drawings um, what do you guys say should I upload more hand drawings or the way I am doing digital painting uh, Actually, it's an uh, it's over an year I am running this YouTube channel and uh, the growth is very bad. Maybe I am not getting uh, connect with you guys, so I thought I should talk to you guys in this video. So I am voicing over on on this video. I hope this video would really help me to grow. So uh, all this time I have been drawing with my finger and finally the time has came. Uh, going to buy a stylus soon for sharp work in my digital painting. 
the face is not uh, looking like sheetal right now but uh, the f- i like the face it was but uh, i had to change the face because uh, obviously i was uh, focusing on the real picture and i w- wanted to look like sheetal but uh, the way the face is it 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 looks beautiful i don't know who it is but it looks beautiful but uh, eventually uh, i had to change the face because i wanted to as much as accurate like the original picture but uh, i don't know if i did it or i failed i don't think i gave my 100% or this is because of my mobile screen because you know guys when I, when we draw in a small screen that we have to zoom every details and then we have to zoom out then we have to check everything is correct or not it, it it's really uh, feels bad like we need to focus at the same time the whole picture and the small detailing but when we draw in a small screen it really uh, makes uh, everything tough that's what i meant so uh, i am doing the right hand uh, now i'm doing the neck actually uh, when i'm when i draw something like i don't complete uh, a a portion of picture at a time i uh, sometimes i just shade the portion then i will do color the whole uh, i mean the detailing later so i uh, progress slowly first i make the face perfect then uh, slowly i start coloring the other parts then little by little shadow then i started detailing on the if you guys think uh, why i'm talking to you guys uh, so slow because uh, i am not used to it like i don't voice over naturally uh, so i am watching the video at the same time and i'm talking to you guys uh, i don't do voice over much but uh, i really wanted to voice over in this video because uh, it uh, really uh, one of my special arts so i thought i should uh, voice over it so i am watching the video right now and at the same time i'm voicing over so half uh, pardon me for my uh, mistakes uh, i hope i really used to it someday definitely if i uh, continuously working on my voice over so can you guys see that eyes are the key if the eyes are perfect it would re- definitely look like the model you are drawing so i had to focus a lot in the eyes uh, and right now you guys can see that uh, i am focusing on the hair so little bit little bit adjustment i am doing so and i guys i guys told you that i really love the hair okay the can you guys see that uh, i am creating white shadows with pencils so i will say that uh, create the white shadows in a different layer so that when the whole smudging the color and everything will be complete just decrease the opacity of the white hairs so that it would look like uh, highlights or otherwise it would look like a old woman so don't do that mistake uh, draw in a different layer and uh, it feels bad that uh, uh, we cannot create uh, more than 20 layers in autodesk sketchbook but uh, that's the reason i had to uh, merge every layers i don't have a raw file anymore i have the only jpeg file so that's a bad point auto sketchbook otherwise auto sketchbook is very good if they add a, a recording option like procreate that would be really good then i uh, i don't need to buy an ipad so
I have been thinking about uh, buying a uh, buying a laptop, but um, some people are saying that I should buy an iPad. I'm really confused that if I if I uh, buy a laptop, then I, I will uh, get a lot of features that I can do. Like I can do small animations and uh, short stories. I have been thinking about all these things. I am going to do do in my channel. I think uh, I need something more in my channel like only digital digital paintings won't work so i i have been thinking about small animation like short stories uh and uh, i'm going to voice over the stories uh, i have been thinking about all this what do you guys think sir should i do it or i just uh, uh do what i i'm doing right now i i will suggest that leave uh, just create a small uh, layer behind your hair and uh, create small hairs with uh, with the pencil black just small hairs so that uh, it would look re real as you guys can see that uh, I created some hair behind the layer of hair small hairs so that it looks like uh, a little messy because uh, that's what makes the picture more realistic so focus on all this as you guys can see that um, I am create created a, a white shadow and uh, in the cheek and the nose so that the it looks like the face is glowing you can see in the actual picture I am doing the ear but uh, I'm going to give you an unfortunate case that I uh, unfortunately deleted um, I, I mean I accidentally deleted the half of the video of the year are uh, I really tried to recover the lost video but uh, I didn't find it in my Google photos so that was a bad case as you guys can see that my ear is complete now I'm doing the leaves I really uh, got a tough time doing the eyes I really adjust eyes a lot because I wasn't satisfied the uh, real picture uh, the way the real picture is so uh, I'm not happy with the lips too but uh, if I uh, change a little thing in the lips then it would really look bad I tried but I remove it and undo it then I started recording again if I guys uh, truly tell you that uh, I am very weak at uh, drawing lips, uh, lips and uh, nose too. I like, uh, I am very weak at uh, these two portions, but uh, somehow I managed to draw it. I, as you guys can see, that uh, I am uh, having a very bad time doing the face, but. Uh, you know when you draw a beautiful girl you have to focus every details on it you cannot make the art ugly uh, now I'm doing the design in the sari the exact design in the original picture so I was very happy that I made it as I said earlier that I'm really happy with the sari the design and the shadows as you guys can see that I just uh, created a design and then I create a duplicate layer and I rotate the layer then I paste it in the behind of the sari I am really glad that I finally did the voiceover I am very happy the drawing is almost complete uh, now I am doing the ear pieces as I said earlier I, I am I I'm very happy with the ear pieces. I didn't th uh, think that I I can make something like this, but uh, I really focused on the small detailings and uh, it is good, nice. I am happy with the result. Let's see uh, how many views I get. I need your support, guys. If you like this video, give this a thumbs up, definitely comment down below, 
what should I draw next and um, do you like this picture or not and of course subscribe my channel on YouTube and um, follow me on Instagram uh, because I upload all of my drawings on Instagram and sometimes I upload videos on my Facebook page too I will give the link of the Facebook page in the description so uh, go and like my Facebook page and also follow me on Instagram I hope you guys are healthy staying at home and uh, see you in the next video